start by npm installing easy MIDI. Then we want to create a new output, and we can do that by saying new easy MIDI and using output. We'll give this a name, which is a string, and you can name it anything. I'll just name mine Mindy. And because we want this to be a virtual device, we'll pass in true as the second parameter. If you leave off true, it will search for an output named Mindy. If you pass in true, it will create an output named Mindy. With our output, we can begin sending MIDI values. So we can start with a note on, and then an object describing the note that we want to send. So for example, if I want to send a note of C3, this one here, so if you scroll down here all the way to the bottom, you'll see C negative two, so that'd be zero, one, two, three, four, and five. So that's why we're here at five. The velocity can be set to 127, just the maximum value. And whatever track is listening to this, just to make sure you have at least channel one selected, all channels will work as well. If I run this now, nothing will happen because node exits before this gets a chance to really send out. So we'll go ahead and set up a set interval. And this will send this function every one second. So I hit save here, run our script again. You'll hear the note playing every one second. Now you can tell, even after I stopped the script, the note continued to play, and that's because we never sent a note off. So we have to hit stop. So you, you'll see this is still red. So we have to hit stop, or it's still receiving that note on. So the way we'll solve that is by taking all of this and put that inside of a send note function. And then inside of that function, we'll paste this, and we'll also create a set timeout to tell it to time out after whatever time you want. I'll put in 200 milliseconds. And then it'll send the same thing, except we'll send a note off. So I'll hit save here and come down here and type in send note. Now when I run this, you'll hear the notes playing for 200 milliseconds every second. Now you'll also want to, because this and this are the same, want to extract this to something like a note value so that it sends the note value and it also tells it to go off. And then you'd probably want to even extract this into an argument of the function note value so that you could customize which note you send in. We'll just go ahead and pass that in. And this should have the same behavior of playing the note every one second for 200 milliseconds. Then lastly, you probably also want to extract this, the duration of how long the note would be held for into our function as well. So we'll put duration here, and then we can just send the duration of 200 milliseconds into our send note. And just to show this is working, we'll move this down an octave by saying only times four. We'll make this play for a little bit longer, and then go ahead and run this. And now we have a flexible way of sending notes. Thank you.